Okay, so good afternoon, students. Um, today's lesson is going to be the law of cosines. And at the end of the lesson, um, you must be able to use the law of cosines in finding um, the measures of sides and angles of a triangle. So the law of cosines relates the length of a side of any triangle to the measure of the opposite um, angle. So remember um, the lesson in geometry about the SSS or the side, 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 and the SAS or the side, angle, side. So we use those um, like SSS and SAS to, to determine a triangle. And the law of sign does not enable you to solve such as um, a triangle, but the law of cosine does. So if you know the measures of um, enough parts of a triangle to completely determine the triangle, you can solve a triangle using the law of cosine. So we have here um, formulas for the law of cosines in triangle ABC. Let A, B, and C represent the length of the sides of opposite angle A, angle B, and angle C, respectively. So therefore, we have there A squared is equal to B squared plus C squared minus twice BC cosine A. Or if we're looking for B, we have B squared equals A squared plus C squared minus twice AC cosine B. Or if you are looking for C, that's going to be C squared equals A plus A squared plus B squared minus twice AB cosine um, cosine C. So let us use this uh, law of cosine to solve the following um, examples. So example number one, um, the sailboat race committee wants to lay out a triangular course with a 40 degrees angle between two sides that measures 3.5 miles and 2.5 miles. What will be the approximate length of the third side? It says there are multiple choice, but I decided to omit the choices. So it would be like um, you will be forced to solve. Okay, so technically what is missing there is A. So we know that A squared is equal to B squared plus C squared minus twice BC cosine a but that is a a rather the square root of b squared plus c squared minus twice bc cosine a our b is 2.5 our c is 3.5 and our given angle is 40 degrees so a would be um our b is 2.5 so that's 2.5 squared C is 3.5 squared minus 2 times 2.5 times 3.5. Multiply it by cosine 40 degrees. Um, let's, let's do it using the Desmos scientific calculator. So you have there the square root of 2.5 um, squared plus 3.5 squared minus twice 2.5 times 3.5 and then cosine 40 degrees. I express your answer into um, the nearest 10. So that is equal, nearest 100, sorry, two decimal places. Nearest 100, that is going to be 2.26. So approximately, approximately the 
the length of side AC is 2.26 miles. Okay, now you try to solve practice exercises number one.